local news that matters. This is CBS 17 News. Now that Thanksgiving is behind us, the countdown is on for Christmas. And after nearly a year of quarantine, I know a lot of us might be looking to spend big on our loved ones or on ourselves. We don't judge. <laughs> CBS 17's Holder Kowicki joining us live right now at the Super Target store in North Raleigh, where we saw people have already lined up. Well, that's exactly right. The store doesn't even open for another hour. Plus, it opens at 7 a.m., and there are already people out here lining up. They're out here before 5 a.m., and while everybody's social distancing and wearing their masks, there are a few changes, and there are actually going to be people counting who's coming in and out of stores thanks to Governor Cooper's newest mandates. Now, a survey by Travis Credit Union found that 95% of Americans say they're not going to be shopping in stores on Black Friday, and that's bad news for retail business because it's been a tough year, undeniably. Many Americans will be shifting online as they look for a bargain, and the National Retail Federation says this is actually the best day to buy TVs and appliances, but you're not if you're going to be buying toys and computers, the best deals are actually next weekend. What's different about this Black Friday is not only that more and more people are going to be shopping online, but we're going to see a merging of Black Friday and Cyber Monday. The good news is that the deals are going to last all weekend long. The bad news is that items might not last all weekend long. Speaking of items that aren't lasting, they've already come out and told people who are standing in line they do not have any PlayStation 5s or that new Xbox that have been such high items already this year. But Amazon is already saying this has been their biggest year yet. And if you prefer the traditional shopping experience, well, a lot of the stores around here are opening up at 7 o'clock. And you are going to experience some lines, though, simply due to those capacity limits that we referenced just a little bit earlier. Reporting live in Rally Holden Krowicki, CBS 17 News. Yeah, Amazon made enough money. Shop small this year. Walmart and Best Buy both opened at 5 o'clock this morning. And then home improvement stores, Lowe's, and Home Depot, they're going to start with the Black Friday deals beginning in, oh, 15 minutes at 6. Well, Black Friday is traditionally one of the biggest shopping days of the year. The BBB has some suggestions to help you shop this year. They want you to keep in mind that some sales run through Monday. They also suggest checking store hours before heading out and shop online if you can. Make sure those websites are safe. 